also the city of uh, Marathon, along with the county, um, bought a prop piece of property, the old Seven Mile Marina, Salty's, what people know it at, and that's going to be used for, to, to complement the, the operations of the old Seven. And uh, there'll be a trolley there, you can park there, I believe there's going to be about 30 to 40 parking spots. Park there, get on a trolley, and then they can bring you up, and they can take you all the way down to Pigeon Key if you don't want to walk, uh, or take your bike. Or, or run down there. So that's going to be really nice and that's going to be here in the next few months. The uh, City of Marathon is working really hard to make that happen. They're having a trolley built just for this purpose. So I'm sure that's going to be very nice and give people the access to Pigeon Key and the old Seven Mile Bridge. So one of the things that we need to do is put a financial plan together. How was this going to be? One of the things that the Governor Scott wanted and his Chief of Staff Adams Hollywood, he said wanted everybody to have skin in the game. Uh, that they were going to help out the majority of it, but that he wanted Monroe County and the City of Marathon to have skin in the game. So I put together a spreadsheet. I think we're going to show it here in a minute. And that's what started it all. And we all work together. We're all paying our fair share, not only for the, uh, the work that had to be done, the capital work, but the maintenance year after year. And that's very important because, as you can imagine, over water, all this metal has to be maintained, has to be painted every 10 years. Very expensive to paint something like this. Uh, so we're putting money away so we can paint it 10 years from now and do some of the other work that needs to be done. Well, as a county administrator, now the next month will be 14 years. And I had my eye on this bridge since day one. And I just thought it was, uh, it was just shameful that we couldn't use it. It closed right around the time I started in 2008, 2009, if you remember, it closed for, for, for traffic. So I really wanted to make this happen and, and really the county commission, uh, the state, and, and the city came together and made that happen. It's been very exciting. I can say for the rest of my life as I drive by, you know, I had a piece of that and that's something that's I'm very, very uh, uh, honored to be a part of. And hopefully I'll stay healthy enough where I can continue to, to run on it every, you know, two or three days and enjoy this beautiful scenery.